Good morning grade 1 students and I know that you are all excited to learn about our new lesson. But before that, I want you to open your pupil's book on page 28. Okay? Okay, so in our previous lesson, we talked about the shops that we can see around our neighborhood. Such as we have libraries, we have police station, fast food restaurants, clothes shops, cinema, and many more. But for today, our new lesson talks about let's go shopping and it will um, talk about supermarket. So we will be focused on the supermarket. We will also going to try to learn more about the 26 alphabets, um, the consonant sounds and the vowel sounds. And we are also going to talk about the A, A and N article. Okay, so guys, have you tried going to the supermarket? I know that you are, or you all tried to go there. And inside the supermarket, we can see a lot of things we need in our everyday life. So we have here milk. I know that you love milk. We also have here canned goods. We also have here jam, chips, juice. We also have here eggs. We have here bananas, we have here pineapple, we have here orange, um, apple, cheese, and we also have here grapes. Okay, so these are all um, things that we need inside our house and we can buy all of these things inside the supermarket. Now, let's proceed with the 26 alphabets. So before we talk about A and an article, we will try to learn what are the consonant sounds and the vowel sounds. Now let's try to go back to our alphabet. So we have here A to Z. Now I'm going, or A to Z, I am going to um, tell you what are the vowel sounds here. So A is A vowel sound. B, C, D, these are all consonant sounds. E is also a vowel sound. F, G, H is a consonant sound. I is a vowel sound. J, K, L, M, N are all consonant sounds. We have here O, that is a vowel sound. P, Q, R, S, T are all consonant sounds. U is a vowel sound. V, W, X, Y, Z are all consonant sounds. So all in all, we have one, two, three, four, and five vowel sounds. Now, we can use an article which are a and an if we are going to talk about one thing. So we have to know if the noun is or if the noun starts with a vowel sound or if the noun starts with a consonant sound before we can be able to use these articles. Now we use a before a noun that starts with one thing or one consonant sound. So for example, we have here milk. So milk starts with letter M. And M is a consonant sound, so we can say a milk. We also have here jam. Jam starts with letter J. So this is a consonant sound. We can say a jam. Banana starts with B, consonant sounds, we can say a banana. Pineapple starts with letter P, so we can say a pineapple. And we also have here cheese, we can say a cheese because it starts with letter C. So all of this are goods that we can find at the supermarket. We can also uh, use this article, an article, if the noun starts with a vowel sound. So we have here app, 
apple. Apple starts with letter A. And we said that A is a vowel sound. So we can say an apple. Egg. It starts with letter E. It's a vowel sound. So we can say an egg. Ice cream. It starts with letter I. So we can say an ice cream. Orange starts with letter O, so we can say an orange. And umbrella starts with letter U, so we can say an umbrella. So this noun are all one thing. Now, if the nouns are two or more, then we can just add S at the end without adding an article. So for example, we have here banana. So if you try to observe here, we have three bananas. So instead of saying banana, then you can add S at the end. So you will say bananas. We also have here orange. Instead of saying orange, if there are two or more orange, then you can say oranges. We also have here ice cream. So if there are two or more, then you can just add S at the end, ice creams. And we also have here umbrella, or we can say umbrellas. Okay, so that's it for the lesson for today. Now remember guys, you can only add the a and an article um, before a noun if they are one thing. But if they are two or more, do not add any article, just add S at the end of the word. So I am going to post some um, worksheets on the platform and I hope you enjoy and thank you so much for listening. Have a great day.